Yo, it's the exam coach, checking in with you. Now that exam season is in full swing, a lot of you have been mentioning a revision website called Seneca Learning. You've been asking me whether I'd recommend it to help with your content learning and content memorization. The short answer, is yes. In this video series, I'll cover how and why Seneca Learning works, which I'll do in this video, why Seneca Learning should be your mobile gaming app of choice during exam season, and finally, how to set Seneca Learning up as a mobile gaming app on your own smartphone. Let's get into it. Okay, we're in the mobile app right now. Something to note is the mobile app isn't available on the App Store or Google Play Store just yet. I'll show you how you can manually set up Seneca Learning as an app on your smartphone later in the video series. The Seneca Learning platform contains information which is relevant to many different types of exam taken by students in the UK. It helps students learn and memorize this information using ways proven to be effective by scientific experiments conducted by professional psychologists and studies conducted by the Seneca Learning team within UK schools. There's a free version and a premium version. The main differences between the two are that the premium version contains exam style predicted papers created by teachers and examiners, more fun and efficient hyper learning courses. I'll get into what hyper learning actually means and my interpretation of it in the next section of the video, exclusive questions and explanations, the best memory techniques for remembering information. Essentially, if you want a more thorough and detailed revision experience in order to break into those higher grade bands, get onto premium. Considering the per month cost of the popular package is less than 20 chicken nuggets from Mackey D's, I'd say this is a reasonable investment to be making in yourself this exam season. The Seneca platform functions using an algorithm which recognizes and adapts to the questions you answer correctly and incorrectly to ensure the revision you are doing is efficient and effective. This is my understanding of what Seneca has termed hyperlearning and how it can save you time and make you more successful in your exams by ensuring all the time you spend revising is as effective as it can be. The platform uses four important learning and memorization principles. Retrieval. The Seneca platform will give you some new information to read through or look at. Shortly after, it will present you with a test question. This encourages your brain to actively engage and attempt to retrieve information, as opposed to passively reading through lots of information. This kind of testing is proven to be more effective in helping students memorize information. Seneca's algorithm mixes together or interleaves topics so your brain becomes better trained at distinguishing between them. This is as opposed to block learning where you would answer similar questions over an extended period of time and then move on to a different set of questions. Having clarity about what information is relevant to each topic within a subject is really important in order to be able to apply the information correctly to questions in an exam situation. Spacing. Seneca will serve you questions based on your past performance. If you answer a question incorrectly, it will test you on that topic sooner than a question or topic you have previously answered correct. This means you're learning the information you really don't know, which is important for filling gaps in your knowledge prior to the exam. Visual cues. Images, GIFs, and short videos are used within the course content. In general, this type of content creates stronger memory associations than words alone. Also, it just helps with the general banter levels in order to keep things upbeat and interesting. Okay, so that's how Seneca works and why it works. But how exactly can you start to use it as part of your everyday life during exam season. Just because Seneca Learning works doesn't mean you're gonna use it. You and I both know it's gotta compete with some of the most popular and addictive apps out there. Here's the first thing I recommend you do. Change the way you perceive it. Instead of seeing it as another geeky revision app, see it as a gaming app. Just like you would Angry Birds, Candy Crush, or Clash of Clans. I'll get into the reasons for this and why it will help you spend more time on Seneca Learning during exam season in the next video.